Hello everyone and welcome in this video. Today we will see how we can handle uh, advanced payment uh, by a customer within the point of sale application. Sometimes it happens that a customer uh, comes to your shop, your bar, your restaurant and he asks you if it's possible to uh, pay in advance an amount to be sure that he can use it for the next uh, few weeks, months, etc. So sometimes, for example, my customer says, I want uh, to pay you 100 euros in order to be able to buy stuff uh, with that uh, amount for the next month. Um, let's see how it works uh, in the point of sale application. So what we will use will be uh, the customer account. This is a new payment method that have been introduced in Odoo Point of Sale uh, version 15 and that allows you to um, give some credit to your customer, etc. But it can be used also in the other way around and um, it allows your customer to make some deposit. So there are four steps to follow to ensure that it will work correctly. First, ensure that uh, the customer account payment method is uh, set uh then um i would say sell this credit demand uh this deposit to your customer we'll see how it works directly into Odoo after uh, this short introduction and finally uh, close your post uh, session and then uh, for the next sessions use the customer account for future payment so let's have a look at how it works in Odoo. I'm here uh, in my database. I will go into my point of sale. And as I told you, the first thing to do is to check that um, your customer account payment method is set up correctly. As you can see, the identify customer uh, checkbox, checkbox is checked. So it means it's OK for this. So now I will open my new session. And let's imagine I got my customer, uh, let's say Franklin who comes in my shop and wants to make a deposit for uh, 100 um, euros on his customer account. As you can see for now, his amount due is at zero euro. So I will set my customer and go directly into payment. So he wants to give me the money in cash and um, I just need here to select cash and put the amount of 100. Odoo will directly ask you, do you want to deposit 100 euros uh, to Franklin? And uh, I mean, for me, it's Franklin. For you, it's your own customer, of course. And I will click on yes. And as you can see here on the receipt, uh, 100 uh, euros have been um, posted in cash as uh, it's been decreased on the customer account. So let's close my point of sale session now. OK. I can see here I need to put the right amount of cash I got in my uh, cashier box and I will close my session. Let's now uh, say we are three, three days later and my customer comes to buy a chair, for example, I don't know. Um, yeah, let's say a chair. I will now select my customer and it tells me, oh, remember, I just uh, put some money on my uh, customer account. I want to use this to pay. Uh, I just need to select my customer again, Franklin. And as you can see now, the amount due is minus 100 euros. So it means that you owe 100 euros to that customer. So this is the deposit uh, money. So I can set my customer and I will go to payment and now select my customer account payment method. So I can validate and you can see that it has been directly added to the customer account. If I close my session by putting the right cash again, it hasn't changed. You can see on the customer account have been paid 39.93. I can close my session and if I open a new session, now that all the account entries have been made. I can check on my customer and see that the 39 euros have been uh, removed from uh, his customer account. And now uh, he can only use 60 euros uh, from his customer account that have been paid in advance. So that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching.